lovely TTs, welcome back to the channel. It looks like rapper Nicki Minaj decided to completely unfollow Ice Spice and JT. Now, I know that Ice Spice and JT are upset right now. Uh, so, since you want to be fake, I'm going to be fake to you and I will never, ever, 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 ever speak to you again. Every time they do an interview, they always talk about how Nicki Minaj was a female rapper who inspired them to start rapping in the first place and now she decided to completely unfollow them. Now, there's been a lot of speculation going around on why Nicki Minaj decided to unfollow these two female rappers but y'all already know we got the tea let's get into it this article says Nicki Minaj has officially unfollowed both JT and Ice Spice on Instagram following them declining to sign a 360 deal with her label heavy on it now this also says Minaj extends her record as the female rapper with the most fallouts with women in history now I'm not going to even get into that last part y'all are not going to have the barbs coming for me but Nicki Minaj does fall out with a lot of female rappers in the industry okay now we're also going to get into what she had to say on station head because she also decided to talk about some people on station head she didn't really give names but she said that she blocked about eight or nine people and she talks about somebody going bankrupt who knows who she's talking about first let's get into some more information from hot new hip-hop to find out exactly what's going on it says Nicki Minaj is certainly no stranger to beefing with other artists but now some think that she's even cut off some of her former friends earlier today so Social media users noticed that she unfollowed both Ice Spice and JT on Instagram. For those who don't recall, she teamed up with Ice Spice for not one, but two tracks last year, Princess Diana and Barbie World. Now in May, Ice Spice's former friend leaked a few text messages in which she described Nicki Minaj as ungrateful and delusional. Now we all remember that. I'm super surprised that Nicki Minaj did not decide to run to Station Head to talk about what Ice Spice said in these text messages with her friend. I mean, maybe she didn't see it, but I'm pretty sure the barbs tagged her in it. Honestly, I'm surprised that Nicki Minaj did not decide to unfollow Ice Spice when that situation happened. Anyway, she has yet to address this debacle, though Ice Spice did say in her Rolling Stone interview last month, we don't have the closest relationship you know, but we're definitely good. It doesn't seem like you and Nicki Minaj are good, seeing as she just decided to unfollow you. She said at the time, explaining that she only sent those text messages out of frustration. Now, as for JT, Nicki had a history with the city girls but appeared to squash that beef for good a few years ago the ftcu rapper which they're basically talking about Nicki minaj even decided to bring out jt for her pink friday 2 world tour stop in boston in april it appeared as though until last month when social media users just assumed that she was shading jt on a station head rant okay now i think it's pretty clear if you don't know who Nicki minaj is talking about don't say that she's talking about one specific person because she could be talking about anybody when she gets on stage head and she does her rants now i'm going to go ahead and put in this audio of her talking about jt just in the beginning of this year um she wasn't saying anything bad about jt so i don't even know where this is coming from let's get into that audio drag down this girl jt so that she would never know how loved she is in real life so that she would believe that this is how the world actually views her so that she would be discouraged, so that she would be discouraged from going out there and rising to the challenge. If people have to do all of that, they see your potential. So let me say, I'm just so happy that the real is real right now. So no shade being thrown there. I have not heard no audio of her seemingly shading JT. So who really knows where that's coming from? I think people just tried to put two and two together. Now this article also says, of course, all of this is pure speculation and it's also possible that Nikki's unfollows didn't mean anything. Child, we know it means something, okay? It's only time will tell if Nicki Minaj meant this statement or if she'll ever address it publicly. Yeah, we will never know if she decides to address this publicly. Like I said, she did say some shady things on Station Head. We're going to go ahead and get into that audio, and then we'll go ahead and get into the beef between her and her sister. Who was getting blocked said, do you have a real cover for the deluxe? Well, I don't know what that means, 
seeing as they're every one of my album covers is a real album cover seeing as I actually got my hair done and my makeup done and put on clothing and stood there for a photo by, with someone holding a camera and even if I didn't want to I don't have to Okay, all you paid malls that, you know, I know everyone's going bankrupt. You won't bankrupt us, okay? Talent wins. Okay, the pink print doesn't even have a photo of me on it, sweetheart. Okay? Sometimes it's good to sit down. I know you want attention, right? But sit Oh, now you're blocked, along with 10 other people from today on both platforms, okay? Good. <laughs> they so mad that Jack City lives, you know, they mad about that. So, so, um, you know, a lot of people lost their jobs, a lot of people got fired. But let, I'll, I'll use the um, the pink print album cover. How about that? They all listening. You know, they listen because I'm really that girl. I'm really who I say I am. If I wasn't, then why would I say I am? Okay. A lot of money was generated. Praise God. Talent wins. Okay. Talent wins. <laughs> Okay, talent wins, okay? Talent wins. Onika Tanya is who they were coming to see. So guys, I love you very much.
Now, like I said, Nicki Minaj was definitely talking about somebody in that station headline. But we can't say that we're 100% sure that she was talking about Ice Spice and JT. Remember when JT and Glorilla got into it, Glorilla was saying that she heard that JT was going broke. So maybe this is who Nicki Minaj is talking about. She's talking about JT and everybody in the industry is hearing that she's going broke or something along those lines. But hey, she is with Lil Uzi Vert. He got money. Moving on to Nicki Minaj and her sister. It looks like Ming Lee, Nicki Minaj's sister, decided to respond back to what Nicki Minaj had to say about her not too long ago on Station Head. Now, yes, Nicki Minaj decided to confront her sister on Station Head, basically saying like, why would you speak on your family member if you love them? Because her sister Ming Lee had been doing and taking on a lot of interviews and talking about her sister, Nicki Minaj. Well, it looks like Ming Lee decided to respond back because Nicki Minaj was basically saying, look, I was born with the talent. Ming Lee decided to respond back and she said that, nah, she does too. Anywho, let's get into those audios I think y'all think talent like you could catch it like a cold or or maybe people could pass it through the genes even with blood relation what God has given to me is mine you have to go and get your own you have to discover whatever it is that you're great at being a mooch and a clown don't run in my DNA. Oh no, I'm not the queen of rap. I can never be the queen of rap. Let's get that thing. Let's get that thing. Can you make good music? I can try by putting in work and effort and consistency. I could sing. Let's forget, let's not forget God gave me a talent too. It's singing and it's being myself. It's being me. Cool child. If there's anybody who knows anything about beef, Nicki Minaj definitely does. It doesn't matter if it's her sister. If she wants beef with you, she's going to have beef with you. If you cross her wrong, she is beefing. Okay. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section. Do you feel like Nicki Minaj is wrong for beefing with a lot of females in the industry? I mean, she just made connections with Ice Spice and JT. And people love the fact that, especially with JT and Nicki Minaj's relationship, that they could let go of the past and be cool but unfortunately it doesn't seem like it was long lasting or that they can further their relationship but once again thank you for watching room for tea make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel i'll see you guys in my next video have a blessed rest of your night